Five people, including children, were injured this afternoon in a crash in Avalon Park. News 6's Nikki Zizaza is live in the newsroom. And Nikki, you just received an update from investigators. Yes, Lisa, we're learning more about how the multi-car collision Florida Highway Patrol is investigating happened. We've learned a medical episode is what may have caused the crash that sent three children and two adults to the hospital. A wreck involving four vehicles, a mangled car, and a daycare van with kids or kids daycare is under investigation. The bus that you see here to my left and the uh, Mercedes, they were both stopped for a, a red uh, traffic light. Sky 6 captured the scene from above after a 43-year-old Orlando woman in a sedan and a 28-year-old Orlando woman in another car were traveling southbound along Alafaya Trail at Avalon Park Boulevard. FHP says the 43-year-old driver had a medical episode and struck the stop daycare van and another vehicle Friday afternoon. The crash halted traffic and FHP says the collision sent several people to the hospital, including the 43-year-old woman and a 20-year-old man. The other vehicle on the, the other side of the street, the uh, gray vehicle was southbound at a slower speed because she knew that she had a red uh, light and she was going to have to stop. Orange County Fire Rescue says some children were sent to Arnold Palmer, but were not in the daycare van. Lieutenant John Carvalho with FHP describing what happened. She observed the other vehicle, the one that caused the accident, coming in at a faster speed. She tried to go right to avoid a collision, and when she went right, she was still clipped <laughs> by the other vehicle. Meantime, crews swept debris from the site as troopers worked to reopen the roadways. Now, FHP says investigators have recommended that the 43-year-old driver be medically reevaluated. Meanwhile, we are told the three children didn't suffer serious injuries. Live in the newsroom, Nikki Zizaza getting results, News 6. Nikki, thank you.